Good evening, everyone. My name is Kevin Zarnick. I'm the director of the Royal Oak Concert Band. We're excited to present to you our summer, uh, summer program. So we're going to start with a march by one of the two American March Kings. This is Excelsior by Carl King. So once again, we are the Royal Oak Concert Band. We're a community group uh, housed at Royal Oak Middle School, and we perform concerts uh, mainly in southern Oakland County, but every now and then we get to go out past our, our typical area and perform for more of the state. The next piece you're going to hear is a collection of tunes from the early 1900s called Themes Like Old Times. If you were here last year, you heard Themes Like Old Times number two. This is Themes Like Old Times number one, so we're not repeating the tune yet. Uh, you'll hear some popular tunes of the day, such as Alexander's Ragtime Band by the Light of the Silver Moon and 12th Street Rag, just to name a few. Here is Themes Like Old Times.
performing that one. We're going to welcome our uh, house vocalist back up to the stage. Miss Penny Kilgore is a longtime music educator in the Livonia Public Schools, correct? Pardon? Livonia. In the Livonia Public Schools. She's uh, also a fine tenor saxophone player and a fantastic vocalist. I'm trying to stop. She teaches the middle school band primarily, and you spend a few hours at the high school, right? Which one? Uh, orchestra at which high school? Churchill High School. Fantastic. Let's have a switch on it. solo for Mr. Mark Kroll. And also in that, that same medley, it's a nice Barry Sax playing. Nice job, Rachel. We're going to keep this bluesy, uh, funky feeling going on. Oh, we're going to get just a bit more modern, so we went from Dixieland to swing. Now we're going to go to some late pop, uh, early funk. This is a Blues Brothers medley.
Thank you. We're going to feature another soloist, so while he's coming on up, um, let's talk about our band behind me. Um, so the Blues Brothers were on a mission, and their mission was uh, to raise funds uh, to help save their orphanage. We're kind of on a similar mission to raise funds, not necessarily to save an orphanage, but uh, to help uh, secure the financial su uh, future and security of our group. Mr. Don Mary, I'll never know. I won't go into it too much, uh, but if you would like to help us with our mission of raising funds to help guarantee that not, we can not only provide a uh, fine musical performing opportunity for members of our community, but uh, uh, also a great opportunity for the community to hear fine concert band music. Uh, come see either myself or one of our uh, members of the band to see if you'd like to become a sponsor. It was small, it could all help uh, the cause of our group. with us tonight is called Persuasion. It's a piece uh, written a few years back by Mr. Sammy Nestico, one of the fine jazz writers uh, of his time. He spent some time arranging for, I believe, the United States Marine Band, uh, and he wrote this fine solo uh, during the peak of his career. <laughs> Please help me welcome uh, Mr. Don Marriott up. He'll be for this place.
So all that jazz and blues is great. But now it's time for something completely different. Liberty Bell, written by John Philip Sousa in the late 1800s. You might recognize it from Monty Python's Flying Circus, various firework displays. John McCain even used it during his presidential campaign. It's a pretty popular piece, even today. John Philip Sousa was uh, originally from the United States Marine Band. Later on, he found his fame as a professional band director uh, outside of the Marines. Um, but it was his expertise and uh, great composing skills that helped him push not only the Marine Band, but other military bands and civilian concert bands uh, to the next level. The next piece that we're going to perform to you is called Concord. It was written for the United States Marine Band in the late 1980s uh, by Mr. Claire Grunman. Concord is a medley of revolutionary tunes, uh, such as the White Cockade, 
and William Billings version of America. You won't know this one, but you'll hear it. And then uh, Yankee Doodle. But not Yankee Doodle like you used to. Uh, Grumman kind of puts his own spin on it. And then right at the end, he smashes America and Yankee Doodle together in a nice uh, combination. Here is uh, Grumman's Concord.
We had some very nice piccolo playing uh, by our principal flautist, Miss Bonnie Ben. I'm not sure what's next. The band reminds me. Our next tune is called Joshua. It's arranged by Mr. Paul Yoder. And it's just a little bit different than the one you'll hear at church. Music from the motion picture in The Incredibles. We're going to start with the opening title scenes and then uh, music from the end credits, which the composer calls the in credits.
strictly patriotic section of our uh, program right now. We're going to start off with uh, music by a Yankee Doodle Boy himself. This is selections from the George Cohan songbook. I'm sure you know him.
give it up for our euphonium section. Betsy and Ted. They had a lot of melody in that last game and did a nice job on it. Our next piece has some audience participation and I'm going to bring the, uh, the microphone even closer to our band president. And while the band is setting up, I'm going to just say a few more words about our cause. So once again, if you, a loved one, or your uh, business can help support our cause, uh, we would love to hear from you. Please come and uh, either find us on Facebook, we have a website, or come and see one of our people dressed in blue tonight. And uh, if you'd like to sponsor our ensemble, we would love to have your help. Uh, if you play a musical instrument and are not exercising that ability right now, we would love to have you join us for our fall series. We rehearse on Monday evenings at 7 o'clock at Royal Oak Middle School. And uh, rehearsals are open to community adults. And I believe we take ambitious high schoolers as long as they want to make our rehearsal schedule. So if you play an instrument, we would love to have you. This next piece is very special. We're going to honor the service men and women in our band and our audience. Uh, we're going to perform our Armed Forces Salute. When you hear if you have served or are serving and you hear your branch's song, please stand and be recognized. Our president, Emily Boris, is going to announce the tunes before we play them.
the Navy. tribute to all of America right now. This is the great current dragon arrangement of America the Beautiful.
On behalf of the Royal Oak Concert Band and its board of directors, I would like to sincerely thank uh, the Royal Oak Public Library for hosting us yet again. We would love to come back again if you'd love to have it. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. It's been a great audience. Okay, we've got one more before they go. We've got one more before they go. Oh, you have one more? Yeah, yeah, okay, how about good. that? All right, good. This is our national... We've got to pretty soon, right? We're done, we're done. No, no. Another two and a half minutes. All right, no, that's all right. Here's our national march. Have a great night, everyone.